I did finally apply for the ANCC exam. Another little budgeting tip that I've been working on. If this is the only day I work this week, I am like ugh, so over this. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I have quite a few updates in this video. So the first update, which I think is pretty important because if you guys have seen this video right here, you guys know that I was not sure whether I was going to be taking the nurse practitioner board exam or not. But in the month of February, I made it a goal to decide whether I was going to take the NP board exam or not and which one I was going to take because there's two as family nurse practitioners. We have two different options of which ones to take and I wasn't really sure that I was going to do it or not because they like my nursing job. But I think it's probably the best thing to do just take the board exam and then kind of go from there see where life takes me but yeah I did finally apply for the ANCC exam and I will be taking that exam I don't have a date yet of when I'm scheduled because I'm still waiting for approval to even schedule the exam and of course I have to study and all that but I did apply for it so I'm waiting for that to be approved and honestly it's like a little scary to <laughs> even like think about it because it's like uh i'm gonna be like stressed out again having to study so i'm trying to figure out what study tools will be best for me which i think i've narrowed it down to two um one of them will be true learn which i've used in the past during np school and i have a discount code for you guys i'll put it down in the description box and in the comments i'll pin it so you can get um some money off for like a 90 day prescription a prescription 90 day subscription so I'll put it down in the comments and in the description box for you guys if you guys want to check out TrueLearn because it also has Picmonic, which is such an amazing resource. So that's going to be one study tool that I'm going to be using, but I also want to incorporate a second one, which that one I'm still researching. If you guys have passed the ANCC exam, then let me know or even the A a and P exam. It doesn't matter. If you guys have passed it, please let me know in the comments what board exam review which one you guys used to help you guys pass because I'd like to know like which one is the best one. Of course we all learn differently but I think it's important to like also use a second tool so I'm going to be using a second one and then after that I'll let you guys know in another video what study tool I ended up deciding to use. I'm back from grocery shopping. I'm gonna make myself a latte because I had coffee this morning, but it was like just in instant coffee. But I forgot to mention this morning that I actually saved some money on the ANCC application that I submitted. So I think it was $395. Sorry, I'm trying to open the milk. And I used a 25% discount code that they had available on the website so i used that and i brought it down to 296 dollars and 25 or 75 cents i don't know but i'm so glad i saw that and it's only for the month of march pretty much i'd say if you ever have to buy anything online look for a discount code because there's gonna be a discount code somewhere and i luckily i went through the site and like was actually reading and i found the 25 percent uh, discount code without having to be a ANA member so that's a win because I didn't want to get the ANA membership um, so yeah I mean I saved $99 but this has been my favorite pod as of lately this one and the Bianco Dopio I am finally gonna go over to get as the signature for my retirement account to be rolled over if you guys didn't see that video i explained the whole issue but i finally got a hold of somebody i'll put the video up here up here somewhere up here and i'll down in the description box so you guys can understand i was pretty much having an issue transferring my retirement account over to my new employer but anyways i have an appointment at 10 o'clock to get it signed i am like so over this but Let's go get it signed and then <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you guys how it goes. I mean, it should go fine, right? It better be. You guys, I am so happy. I got everything filled out and she signed it and 
it's taken care of and she even faxed it to them ordered my starbucks and for some reason i always forget that i have gift cards and i never use them and it's such a waste of money so now i'm like trying to search for all my gift cards that i have in my purses and everything and i have two here that i'm gonna use and hopefully it'll pay for my two lattes that way i don't use my own money um that's also like another little budgeting tip that i've been working on if you get gift cards make sure you use them instead of like forgetting that you have these gift cards i hope it at least covers one latte this is gonna have two dollars to cover the whole thing oh. check the balance on this one yes please Cool. This will be 350, okay? Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. I don't know why you said that. Bye. Okay. They never have sleeves here. I don't know why. Do I have to buy my own sleeves now? Probably. So I need her double cup. I feel like anytime I ask for anything extra, not extra, but it's like, I don't want to burn my hand, you know? Like, I kind of feel bad. So anyways, got my latte. I'm happy that I didn't have to use my money. So, cheers to that. Heading out to dinner with my boyfriend. We're gonna go eat Italian food. And I'm so excited, because I've never been there and the food looks so freaking good. Brought some dessert home. It's a chocolate chip cannoli. I'm out of work. I got out like 30 minutes late because I was working on a case that was taking a little long. I was gonna go buy some donuts, but honestly traffic was insane that I was like, nope, definitely not going. But anyways, overall work was good. It was a good day. Um, I just, you know, just cause I got 30 minutes late, but it's all right not really a problem i mean as long as i get paid i'm cool with it so i was gonna get donuts i really was but then i started thinking okay i really don't want to eat a sandwich again for dinner because i had that yesterday and i ended up picking up some panda panda express for dinner i'm gonna eat this enjoy it and then watch the bachelor and catch up on like darcy and stacy or is it Stacy and Darcy? I don't know, but either one of those from TLC. Um, I'm gonna catch up on my shows and then just call it a night because this is the only day I work this week. Tomorrow I'm gonna be off and I'm gonna plan. I have to edit this video actually to get it up for you guys. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications and I will see you guys on my next video.